Instead of just saying, write a product description, you can say, write a product description following these examples. And then obviously, give the examples. Once you've provided the example, you can then say, create a similar description for our solar powered camping lantern. And finally, be sure to set your constraints. Set clear boundaries by specifying things like length, tone, language level, format, topic, and time frame. Let's see these principles in action with a business use case. A basic prompt might be, help me write a marketing post about a new productivity app. While a professional prompt may say something more like, act as an experienced social media marketer. Create a LinkedIn post about our new productivity app. Include a hook in the first line, two to three key benefits, one customer success metric, a clear call to action, and be sure to format using bullet points and emojis where appropriate. Maximum 200 word length, and be sure the tone is professional yet conversational. Do you notice how the structured prompt leads to a more focused, useful result? We're using ChatGPT again, but today we'll create a prompt template you can reuse and modify for different purposes. Your 60 second challenge, create a reusable prompt template for something you do regularly. Try meeting summaries, email responses, product descriptions, and tutorial writing. Include the role assignment, instructions, desired output structure, any examples, and any constraints. Here are some pro tips as you build your prompting skills. Start broad, then refine. Use clear, active language. Include examples when possible. Test with variations. Save successful prompts and learn from weak results. Common mistakes to avoid. Being too vague. Mixing instructions. Forgetting constraints and assuming AI understands context. Share your best prompt templates with hashtag 30 days of gen AI. We'll explore zero shot prompting tomorrow. See you then.